Hi guys, you're welcome to our YouTube channel with myself, Richie, and my wife, Osmond. Yeah, so you guys have been asking why we chose a weekday wedding. So today, we want to take this time to take you guys through why the reason why we chose a weekday wedding. I don't really know why, but I think she, she has a reason, so <laughs> she's going to share that with me. Okay, so why did we choose a weekday wedding? <laughs> Do I even know? Oh, okay, let's find out. idea of having a weekday wedding came to me after meeting a man who had come to Ghana to you know get married and that was actually like his second time of having a wedding and he shared his reasons with me and you know they seemed to sit well with me so I fell in love with that and then when I met my wife I mean when we were dating I told her about the, this weekday wedding thing and uh you know she bought into it initially it was hard right yeah because it, before that growing up i had always wanted a grand wedding you know i had wanted a wedding that would be the talk of town so that everybody oh. mentioning my name and all that but after meeting him he changed my perspective on this issue of having a wedding a grand wedding but i think at the end of the day the partners involved should know what suits them best and do what what they want that's all yeah so basically i'm the type of person who is like the behind the scene kind of person i don't want to be everywhere like you know i don't like the numbers i don't like all the attention and all of that so i want to tell something very simple and like short yeah so yeah. when i met her she actually you know understood where i was coming from and she also realized that indeed the weekday was the good thing so we had it <laughs> so basically it was just to cut down numbers it was just to cut down resources it was just uh you know to avoid wasting people's time and because i actually don't believe in that we don't believe in you know spending like a whole day on a wedding and usually when it happens on the yeah, weekend so that's what happens yeah, yeah so yeah. Basically, these are reasons. And unnecessary costs. Uh -huh. Unnecessary costs because yeah. some costs are very unnecessary. You wanted to avoid all these things. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, so we wanted to avoid costs. We didn't want to waste anybody's time. And our time too. Yes, and our time too. <laughs> yeah, and our time too. It was really, really true. Yeah. You yeah. realized that it was a very simple one. And, um, you know, we had like everything on the same, the same day, day from morning to like afternoon we're done yeah and i think having the wedding both were uh, both traditional and white wedding on the same day is really helpful because it enables you to do everything at once and then relax yeah so it's yeah. very helpful yeah. and the cost involved too is better yeah. than having it on different days because you book all the services for one day and then you are sorted you don't have to think of the next day. um you know we felt like when if we, we, we should have it on a weekday, a lot of people are not going to come, you yeah. know, because she has a lot of people. A I crowd. Mean, she has a lot of people. For me, it was okay because I actually have like a few friends and most of these friends were also out of our crowd. So it wasn't like a, big a big deal for me. But she had a lot of people and Blood. she had almost everybody in Accra mm. so it means that we were, <laughs> were to host a, a good number of people and that was actually what we wanted to avoid yeah. main motive behind cutting down the numbers is that we believe that there is marriage after wedding mm. you know yeah, yeah there's marriage and I think mm. that the marriage is more important than just the one day show where people would just come eat enjoy drink, have fun dance, yeah make merry after everything it's about the two of you going mm. to start a life together mm. yeah. and i mean it's difficult yeah. you need to be financially stable you know to some point to be able to handle a family mm. to be able to start life with your wife you know so we didn't want to waste a lot of money on that and uh, go and suffer later so we wanted to have something simple something within our budget something that is not too extravagant and then you know 
just relax, enjoy life, and enjoy our marriage. I also think life is simple, so we shouldn't complicate things. Because with this marriage issue, marriage is a long time journey, you know. So we decided to have something very simple and nice, as he said, and not to waste all our resources into barely six hours program. Yeah. Because we know we have a lot ahead of us, and then we had to plan make investment for that which is ahead of us and not to spend all our lifetime savings on a particular ceremony mm -hmm. so that is what we did and it really helped us yeah mm -hmm. i remember so well that when we were done with everything everybody left <laughs> it was <laughs> just me and my wife <laughs> then i asked her that are we really done are we done yeah, she said yes yeah. we are done you know so, so at that particular <laughs> point reality started you <laughs> know him. hitting us yeah so imagine if we had spent our spent lifetime savings the wedding i mean i i think that it would have even taken away the joy that joy yeah but we were okay because actually we even ha had some money left and that was the first thing i checked actually because <laughs> i wanted I know, to right? be sure of how much we spent, we spent. <laughs> and also to be sure if we exceeded we our, budget, our so. budget or we exceeded you yeah. know because on the day we had some extra money just in case to make up for anything like some unforeseen unplanned situations yeah. that might have come up and it was good i mean <laughs> i was really happy that we didn't go beyond the budget and the extra money was actually kept and it was still intact <laughs> <laughs> and it was helpful <laughs> it was, intact, it was, helpful it was a good way to begin life so yeah. it was just the two of us in a room Mm. Yeah. Was somebody else? No, it wasn't the two, the, the, Holy <laughs> <laughs> it was the two of us. It was the two of us. Yeah. Room. And <laughs> there we realized that marriage mm. had begun. Yes. You know, at like, that so instant, the wedding had ended mm. and marriage, marriage had, begun. had begun. And that was like the most important thing. So yeah. I don't think I don't believe in people wasting resources on wedding if mm. they don't have it. But if you have it and you want to spend, I mean, why not? That, if that's what makes you happy, you can do it. Yeah. But I think that doing it on a weekday mm. saves some kind of resource. It saves you from spending a lot. Mm. Yeah, especially if you have your friends in the working class who will go to work and all of that. So most of them can't make it basically, yeah. and um. that's a way of saving money. Mm. You know? Yeah. Yeah. It's it's a, it's a very good way of saving money. Oh, mm. as you know? said, do what makes you and your partner exactly. happy. Because I think it's all about understanding. Exactly. At this moment, we understood each other, mm -hmm. and it really helped us. Yeah. So if you and your partner agrees to have a grand wedding, why not? What matters is understanding. So whatever you guys agree on, just stick to it. Which and one? Do Which one is a, a grand wedding? like a big a gaganta wedding oh, whereby okay. there'll be lots of artists performing and all that See, that was your dream that was my dream initially <laughs> if i met you and you changed the whole thing <laughs> so, what did you get? so yeah so now i had a simple wedding every day yeah, 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 yeah. and it's nice and we we don't regret yeah. i don't regret it at, at all, all if i'm supposed to choose in my next life of course why wouldn't i choose it yeah. so i think it's one of the best decisions we've ever made mm -hmm. and it's it's that good as young people you know starting, starting life, life it's it's not easy especially mm -hmm. where we come from so i wouldn't advise anyone to waste mm -hmm. all their money on mm -hmm. a wedding <laughs> <laughs> bro don't do it <laughs> Do not let any woman influence you into doing that. Yes, don't help yes, you. Don't yeah. pressure no, him. No, 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 not at all. <laughs> don't do it. Just do what you Feel can afford. Too. Life is very simple. Don't complicate if it. You make it simple for yeah. yourself. Life is very simple. No need know? to complicate yeah. life. Yeah. It's simple as ABC. Yeah. <laughs> so we, we, I think yeah. we, we focus more on the two of us yeah. than pleasing the world. Yeah. And that is yeah. something that yeah. has really helped us. Yeah. And it's helping us in our marriage. Mm -hmm. Because he's someone who has made me understand and believe that it's not about the world. The world would adjust. Just do what <laughs> makes you happy. Oh, yes. So just do what makes the two of you and your marriage happy yeah, and it will work. Yeah, and that's, so. that's true. But having said all this, mm -hmm. I also think that one thing people should notice is that it's not just about having a weed day that will prevent people from coming to your wedding. No. <laughs> <laughs> that is what we thought. We thought having it on a weekday will limit... Oh, yes. It's limited the number yeah, of to people some to some extent. Mm -hmm. Can you guys imagine we budgeted for 150 people, but we end up having almost like a 500. 
<laughs> that's like times three or even oh, more. You know, it's all about you, the two of you. Just get someone who understands you, yeah. you know, and then plan the thing together. Mm-hmm. No secrets, no hidden anything. Yeah. And always day. have extra money mm-hmm. <laughs> for yeah, even on all for six yeah, circumstances. Money, you know. Anything can happen yeah, because in our case. Happen. Maybe another couple would have preferred to yeah. make provision for it. Even though I think there was provision. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. Shout out to Mr. Linda. She did extremely well. Yeah. She made extra, extra, extra so provision. I, am, I want to talk to about something lastly. I think having both a traditional and a white wedding on the same day really helped us. So it's an advice or a tip I want to give to the single ladies yeah, preparing yeah, for yeah, their yeah. wedding. Yeah. If you have your traditional and your wedding, white wedding on the same day helps to book for the services on the same day mm-hmm. so the cost reduces yeah. rather than having it on separate days mm-hmm. whereby you are charged for two days instead of one day and having it all at once yeah. so that's a tip <laughs> i didn't know all of this but now i know yeah thanks to <laughs> yes truly madam wednesday <laughs> yes madam wednesday. wednesday you know who actually call me madam wednesday because we had our wedding on a wednesday, yeah, wednesday. <laughs> yes she did well i should say because uh, i think the decision came from both of us but yeah. she stood because she was actually the one dealing with the people involved before i you know i joined i came down so she did well by standing her feet yeah oh yeah stamping, stamping. her feet yes. <laughs> by stamping her feet and not allowing external influences to get to her not at yeah, all so because a lot of people really uh, they actually discouraged me from yeah, having a yeah, even yeah. my some of my friends were laughing yeah, yeah. they were laughing at me that ah, who mm-hmm. does a wedding on a wedding mm-hmm. day but i am so i think they yeah. they rather recommended uh, weekdays to yeah. others <laughs> so, so that's good. it because you are going to get numbers Personally, i never posted my wedding anywhere i i i spoke to friends like individually people I wanted to invite i spoke to them individually but on the day, <laughs> I saw faces that I never called them to invite them. So and not that we are bothered. Yeah, we are not bothered yeah. about it that mm-hmm. they are attending. Mm-hmm. But we just want you to, you guys, to understand that there will always, always be, be extra. extra yeah. yeah. So, so you always have imagine to imagine if you extra. were doing it like on a weekend where everybody is free uh, and they really want. But like basically, it was, yeah, it, was, it, was to, it was to cut down the numbers. numbers. And it was to have like a simple thing without spending so much money. And it was also to, you know, to have it being more like, you know, like fun field. Yeah. You know, like more, like, because it was Even though it was a simple ceremony. Yeah. Guys, we, we, if you are new to this channel, subscribe, subscribe. like, mm-hmm. and share this video. If you want to yes. see more of us. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yes, you are going to see more of us, you know. Yeah, because, um, hopefully, hopefully. Yeah, she's been able to convince me to appear here, so yeah. I will appear often. And then I'll share some stuff with you. Yeah. Take care, have a good time, <laughs> do what makes you happy, don't listen to people. And don't Live give your, your partner any pressure, unnecessary pressure. Yeah, 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 yeah. it's important. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so see you guys. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye.